rural county in our area is hoping new technology can help patients get the specialized care they need without having to drive miles away. It's called telemedicine, and Local 15's Madupe Idowu got to see how it all works. Yeah, Kim, it operates much like a video chat. There aren't many specialists in rural areas like Washington County. Health officials hope this Skype-like technology will change that. If uh, I had to go to Mobile, uh, I wouldn't be able to go see him near as often. About 17,000 residents in Washington County depend on this hospital. I came to uh, visit with my father, who's 91, in the hospital, and I'm uh, very, very grateful that the hospital's here. It's the only one here, equipped with 25 beds, an emergency room, and nursing home. It provides a much needed service to the small rural community. But then, for uh, so many specialists that are in Mobile, Birmingham, that very often people go on to a specialist. It's something that CEO and director Douglas Tanner would like to change, bringing specialists to the patients virtually. It's a very innovative technology that we've invested in. It's called telemedicine, and much like Skype, a doctor can see a patient no matter where they are, meaning a specialist can make a diagnosis even though they're miles away. Specialists like neurologists who aren't currently in the county. The ER physician that's by the bedside would be able to communicate the neurologist would even be able to see the CT scan that we've done here. Tanner says the new program would include psychiatrists and wound specialists. It would prevent us from having to put that patient in an ambulance and transfer them down to Mobile. The hospital has spent more than $20,000 on ambulance trips. Tanner believes telemedicine is the answer to the shortage of care in rural counties. Telemedicine is unlimited. Now, doctors in Mississippi and Georgia are already using this technology, and Tanner hopes to get the program started soon. The hospital is searching for willing doctors to participate here in Mobile and Baldwin counties. Kim and Greg? That's a great way to use technology, especially yes. for a state like Alabama. It has so many rural counties, and a lot of people have to go a long way to get that kind of treatment. It's going to help them a lot. Yeah. Well, fog delayed the men's.